the A model radar is a fantastic radar as compared to like the F4 and the F106 and the previous ones. It was, you know, game changing as far as its increase in capability, but it definitely had some significant kind of little quirks that you had to work out in more of an analog fashion. And what I mean by that is as the pilot, you need to know that in the A model, you're going to have certain blind zones where the processor is, he's running as fast as he can, but he's a little tiny computer. And every once in a while, he just can't process things. And there will be very specific times in the, in the engagement timeline where the, the targets are going to disappear off your radar potentially because they're in what we call a blind zone. We knew where they were. And as the operator, you just kind of have to get patient, sit back, smoke a lucky, wait for him to pop out of the out of the blind zone, then grab your sort and shoot and crank and do all that other neat stuff that every you know all the eagles were doing at the time. But the A model, those were some significant limitations that you had to live with as compared to the C models, which were down the street, but they had the what was called the PSP programmable signal processor with about, and this is gonna sound exceedingly small, but it was a one megabyte radar memory, if I remember correctly, as compared to ours, which was like 32K or 64K. It was, you know, the Commodore computer that my kids were playing with at home had about the similar computing memory size as the airplane I was flying during the day.